what a stunning sight to look up in the night sky and see the full moon shining brightly. That's not its own light you're seeing. The moon can't generate light, but its surface does reflect the light of the sun, 93 million miles away. The moon is on average 239,000 miles from Earth. It's just over a quarter the size of the Earth, and compared to its host planet, it is the largest proportionally of all the other moons in the solar system. But because of its large size, ocean tides here on Earth are created by the gravity of the moon, which actually helps to circulate the warm and cold waters of the ocean. Unlit areas of the moon's surface can reach a shuddering temperature of minus 280 degrees Fahrenheit, while the sunlit daytime portions can reach temperatures of up to 260 degrees. Our moon occupies an elliptical or an oval-shaped orbit around the Earth, and it completes one orbit every 27 and one-third days. It spins on its axis once each orbit, meaning that we always see the same side. In fact, until spacecraft were created to visit the moon, we didn't even know what the far side looked like. But an occurrence known as libration results in the moon rocking back and forth, and it allows us to see just a bit more than half. Because of libration, we can see 59% of the moon's surface. All in all, the moon is a beautiful example of God's careful and intricate design. I'm David Reeves. Truly, the heavens declare the glory of God. Sign up for our email updates at davidreeves.com to receive free content and videos. That's davidreeves.com. The mysteries of the universe unfold in a manner that is easily understood.